everyone, this is Lorena with the lovely Jessica Sanchez, and we're here at the second annual H2O Music Festival. Welcome, Jessica. Thank you. Is this your first uh, H2O Music Festival? It is, and I'm performing, which is amazing. Great, great. And uh, now your whole uh, backstory is pretty interesting. I mean, you've graced some pretty amazing platforms from, you know, the Democratic National Convention. We've got two NFL games that you've uh, sang, the Star Spangled Banner. Uh, American Idol, of course. Yeah. Let's not forget where uh, this all started. Uh, and what's next after after you grace these stages? I have no idea. <laughs> I've done already like so many things, like you said, and then I've done Glee on top of that, which is like acting stuff. So I definitely love to act and all that. Um, but I'm doing big events like this too, where it's like live and just like I, I love it, and I hope to do more soon. Absolutely. And then. Uh, Speaking about uh, Glee, when it, did you always have a passion for acting, or is it? Uh, how did you become involved with the arts? Ryan Murphy called me like right after finale of American Idol and was like, "Hey, we want you to be on the show." And I was like, "Okay, but I've never acted before." But then he was like, "We still want you to be on the show." So I just took acting cl acting uh, acting classes, and then I studied, and that was about it. But I love it; it's fun. And now I also heard you were uh, you you are also homeschooled, or are you continue con continuing that? I just that? finished school. I just so, turned eighteen. <laughs> perfect. Yeah. So how was that whole process? I mean, was it the whole entire four years that you were homeschooled? Yeah, or was for high school and then um, middle school down. I was uh, in public school and I would, had a lot of drama going on with girls and guys and you know all that. Got it. So I was tired of <laughs> done with it. So I was so happy to be homeschooled. And you're a you're a native of California. Yes. And. Um, where else? Uh, where else? Where you performed? Have you really enjoyed kind of uh, any the crowds and uh, West Coast internationally? Everywhere, everywhere. Everybody's different, you know. Yeah. Uh, the, the crowds are always giving me different vibes, and I love every single vibe that they give me. Um, but definitely, like California is home for me. <laughs> San Diego is more home for me. LA is a little busy, <laughs> but San Diego is like where it's at. Chula Vista, that's where I'm from. Now, uh, what are your dream collaborations with uh, any? artists out there that you I mean, I've already to. collaborated with Neo and Prince Royce. I mean, so that's already done. amazing. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, yeah, there's tons of people that I love and I would love to collaborate with, so. And now I was, uh, I was hearing about this new duet that you're... Uh, what is it, this new project that you're working on? Is it a duet specific uh, artist? Oh, um, today I'm going to be performing with ah, uh, Prince Royce. Okay. Yeah, we're All doing right. a duet. So a little sneak peek into what's going to happen next. Yeah. And now um, moving on to a, a pretty, a uh, little bit more serious topic with Jenny Rivera coming up on a, a year, it's almost a year that, uh, you know, her tragic death. Mm -hmm. Uh, did your parents or did you at all were exposed to any of her music? Um, I have uh, my best friend um, that, you know, showed me a couple of her stuff uh, uh, a little bit a little while ago. And um, I love her music and she's really made a huge impact on the world and on the Latin side of the music. So um, definitely I want to send the condolences to her family and to everybody. So it was very tragic and um, she's a legend so she'll live on forever. And uh, what do you think her legacy will be now that uh, after she's passed away and other artists, you know? Well, she's definitely a like, huge artist and very, very talented. Um, and she shared her talents with the world. Uh, she sold so many records, and it's just amazing. And she kind of, you know, made um, the Latin music stand out a little bit more. And she helped that um, with the Latin artists and everything. So she's just, you know, a legend herself. Well, congratulations. It was Thank a pleasure. You. Good luck on stage. Thanks so much. No problem.